bit. I actually got my root canal done, so it's quite sore. <laughs> There's cinemas upstairs and on this level. So yeah, it's quite nice. Having a lazy buffet brunch. Let me just show you the place. And I am tasting a bunch of wine. So I finally reached Hong Kong airport on my way to Mumbai So I am just transiting on my way to Mumbai and I'm a complete mess because I never wear makeup while I'm traveling and I'm quite tired as well. I didn't get to sleep much on the plane. So let's go I love Hong Kong airport, I love huge airports because um, I can explore more, like I can't sit still at an airport. I have to check out all the shops and find stuff to buy and find stuff to eat. <laughs> I will show you my outfit. Hey guys, so I've completely forgotten to vlog while I've been in India and I knew that was going to happen because that's what happens when you aren't regular with your vlogging so today I did quite a bit I actually got my root canal done so it's quite sore um, after that I went and tested out a new gym near my house which is probably where I'm going to start going from tomorrow after that I went and got my hair done just because I just couldn't be bothered to wash it myself so I got it blow dry and as you can see my hair is really long and really thick so it's really hard to do it myself anyway um, now I'm actually going out with a friend, I, my ex-flatmate who I haven't met in months. So we're going out to an evening coffee slash uh, eating kind of uh, outing um, before my boyfriend comes home and I spend dinner with him. So I'm looking forward to meeting all these people before I... Um, go back to Australia for a couple of months. So Let's go. Oh, and I'm really sorry that I haven't shown you a lot more of Bombay um, I actually went out to the most beautiful Valentine's Day sunset dinner and I can't believe I forgot to vlog that I'm such an idiot. I so should not be a vlogger <laughs> But um, I'm hoping I'll get better. So you'll see more and more interesting stuff as I go long and you know what i really really hate the lighting in india it's so filthy like i don't know like look at that the lighting is just so bad in australia it seems to be so clean i don't know maybe it's just me but rant over hey guys so i did forget to vlog yet again last night when i went out with my friend but i didn't forget today i'm actually going to an event for Fancy Pants the store which is an amazing new e-commerce store in India and they're doing a collaboration with this designer Kresha Bajaj and I love uh, her design so it'll be really nice to see how they come together so yeah let's go have a look so as predicted I forgot to vlog at the event and now we're shooting so this is a beautiful kaftan that I got from this beautiful lady in Sydney so we're just shooting this um, today and I remembered to shoot the shoot even though I forgot to shoot the actual event so something Sometimes it's, it's difficult to sort of um, maybe do all of it at the same time, and when and so when you can do something like shaving at your convenience in the comfort of 
your office or your home or in your bathroom, yeah. wherever, wherever, yeah. without any, why not? Why not? You can say that now. <laughs> well, thank you very much, Deepika. I will be asking you a few more questions just a bit. Uh, choose your seat wherever yeah, you like to sit. Feature about this one. It has a bar, gel bar. Mm -hmm. Which moisturizes. Wow. I was telling the girls earlier, I think this is, you can have a bath with this. It's, it's a multi purpose thing. <laughs> right. So we're at the movies here to watch uh, an Indian movie called Rangoon. It should be good. And the cinemas in um, Bombay are so much more fancy than the ones in Sydney for some reason. I think it's just the population so they make them a lot bigger. So I'm just waiting outside the theatre and it's not even gold class or anything. It's just normal. And these are the couches. And the popcorn and food bar is huge and there's one on each level so there's cinemas upstairs and on this level there. It's quite nice. Hey guys, so I'm out to lunch with Bay today. We're having a lazy buffet brunch. Let me just show you the place. Hey guys, so I'm at a wine testing or actually the Spring Fest at the club in Mumbai um, and I am tasting a bunch of wine and then I'm going to go over there behind me, I don't know if you can see, to get a foot massage and yeah, there's some great music, great vibe, great weather, so we're going to have an amazing time. Hi guys, so I know you can't see me properly but I haven't been partying in Bombay properly like forever so I've decided to go bar hopping in Bombay today we're going to five different bars and we just went to one and we're on our way to the second one so it should be quite an interesting night okay, so this is place two So it's my last week in India and I just got my wisdom um, tooth surgery done so I haven't been to the gym in a week and I finally went to the gym um, for the first time after my surgery and it's still quite swollen but I um, took the chance because I felt really sick because I wasn't working out and I'm currently in an auto rickshaw which is one of those tiny little um, transportation vehicles, kind of like tuk-tuks and the driver is staring at me because I am talking to myself but he doesn't know so it's okay. This street that we're going to now is actually a market and you can literally find anything here like from chocolates from Dubai and Europe to uh, wedding outfits to garments to absolutely everything it's 
It's crazy. Even gold and diamond jewelry, mobile phones, watches, like literally everything.